Okay, so um, after like recording this video and talking non-stop, my mic was not on. So yeah, all the information that I put in this video was out the door, so I will tell you guys right here. So pretty much what this new strategy is, is um, you just follow every single big rock. I'm not gonna uh, cut this video at all because I did get a lot of big rocks. So yeah, once you find a big rock, just keep on going straight. Don't change your direction at all. Uh, never stop for anything. The only thing you stop for is tear a shark because they will destroy your boat and they will knock you off the boat. So what I recommend is finding a group of people of uh, five or six. You don't want to do too much because people will fall off the boat and you will just have to wait for them, which takes a lot of time. And yeah, you would probably want like one or two Buddhas uh, just so that you can destroy some piranhas when they uh, attack you. But yeah, this technique, I cannot tell you that it 100% works. But the last two times that I've done it, including this one, I have been getting the Leviathan around like 6,000 or 7,000 meters. Usually you'll find Leviathan around 8,000 or 9,000 meters. But then most importantly, uh, try to find a group of people that actually has a brain because this can take really long. So like a lot of people will just lose their mental and they will just start like going crazy. In this run, I was super lucky. I somehow was able to find uh, the frozen dimension in like 3,000 uh, meters away. So that, that, that's got to be a uh, world record. And yeah, that's how you find the Leviathan. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video. I will show you guys how to get the new fighting style and how to get the shark anchor. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, y'all.